although Andy Cohen is supposed to serve as the unbiased moderator of every The Real Housewives reunion, he has found himself shut down by several memorable cast members over the years. Andy, who is also an executive producer on many Bravo shows, has been involved with The Real Housewives franchise since its inception in the early 2000s. Nicknamed the Godfather of Bravo, Andy is known as the glue that connects the Real Housewives women, and frequently has the Housewives appear on his talk show, Watch What Happens Live. Despite his success as the Real Housewives reunion host, Andy's leadership skills have been criticized as biased and hypocritical by cast members and viewers alike. In fact, Andy's apparent favoritism during the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills season 12 reunion even led to protests for him to be replaced. Whether Housewives have called out Andy's invasive questions or have accused him of playing favorites, there have been several iconic ladies who have gone head-to-head -head with Andy in a compilation shown by TikTok user Chronicles of Bravo. There are many of the most memorable times Andy was shut down by Real Housewives stars and the events that led up to them. Nene Leakes from The Real Housewives of Atlanta Although they used to be good friends, Nene Leakes from The Real Housewives of Atlanta has publicly criticized Andy several times over the years. Nene, who has gone down as one of the most memorable housewives across the franchise, left the series for good after RHOA season 12. Nene and Andy haven't seen eye to eye since, and in early 2022, Nene filed a lawsuit against Andy and Bravo, alleging that they fostered a hostile workplace. While the lawsuit was dropped in August, Nene, who said she was blacklisted from the network, has accused Andy of racism and favoritism in multiple videos. Brandy Glanville from The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills Brandy Glanville was a controversial housewife on RHOBH and continuously found herself in trouble. While Brandy supported Kim Richards when the cast traveled to Amsterdam on RHOBH season 5, Brandy was immediately criticized when she jokingly slapped Lisa Vanderpump. At the RHOBH Season 5 reunion, Andy compared Brandis' impulsive behavior to an untrained dog, and although the comment was a metaphor, Brandy was less than impressed. Brandy quickly snapped, F asterisk 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 you, at Andy and berated him. While Andy and Brandis' former friend Lisa attempted to explain the analogy, Brandy said she would not take abuse from them. Vicki Gunvalson from The Real Housewives of Orange County Vicki Gunvalson was hailed as the AUG of the OC before she was fired ahead of The Real Housewives of Orange County Season 15. Although Vicky's over-the-top personality delivered some iconic Real Housewives quotes, her reputation quickly sank after it was revealed that her ex-fiancé, Brooks Ayers, faked a cancer diagnosis. Although Vicky was already known for her quick temper, viewers were perplexed at Vicky's vicious attitude throughout the RHOC season 14 reunion. After she went off on a Bravo producer backstage, Vicky set her sights on Andy and told him, my temperature's at like 150 degrees. Don't F asterisk 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 do this to me. While Vicky later got into a heated argument with controversial RHOC star Kelly Dodd, she and Andy eventually made up. Ramona Singer from The Real Housewives of New York City Ramona Singer became a household name when she was introduced in the first season of The Real Housewives of New York City. While Ramona was praised for her delusional yet entertaining personality, viewers were most interested in her deteriorating relationship with her eventual ex-husband Mario Singer. At the Roni Season 6 reunion, Andy attempted to find out more about Ramona and Mario's relationship, but Ramona swiftly dodged his questions and tried to change the topic to one of her co-stars. 
Andy continued to push Ramona's buttons which quickly led to an argument over Andy's invasiveness. Although Ramona tried to control the conversation via a deflection, Luanne de Lesseps and Heather Thompson quickly backed Andy up. Denise Richards from The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills Denise Richards became an unexpected fan favorite when she appeared on RHOBH seasons 9 and 10. Although Denise and Lisa Rinna were friends for 20 years before they starred as Housewives, their relationship fell apart on RHOBH season 10 when Denise was accused of having an affair with Brandy. Between the allegation and Denise's decision to send Bravo a cease and desist, all eyes were on Denise at the RHOBH season 10 reunion. Denise felt like she was being unnecessarily questioned by the other housewives, so when Andy called out a contradicting statement, Denise quickly accused Andy of trying to discredit the situation through manipulation. Carol Radziwill from The Real Housewives of New York City Carol Radziwill impressed viewers with her accomplished background and intellect when she appeared on Roni seasons 5 through 10, but it wasn't until Carol's friendship with Bethany Frankel ended that she solidified her position as a fan favorite. In a classic case of miscommunication, Carol and Bethany began to drift apart on Roni season 10 as they battled their respective personal issues. Carol and Bethany's feud split fans down the middle over who was right, but when Andy said Carol bashed Bethany on the show during the Roni season 10 reunion, Carol did not hold back. You're so full of s asterisk 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 Andy, Carol ranted and accused him of being afraid of Bethany. Teresa Judici from The Real Housewives of New Jersey Although Teresa Judici swiftly shut down Andy at The Real Housewives of New Jersey Season 2 reunion, the circumstances were vastly different from the other ladies. Throughout the early years of RHONJ, Teresa was locked in a tight feud with Danielle Staub, although they were briefly friends until RHONJ Season 10. At the RHONJ Season 2 reunion, Danielle found herself at odds with Teresa, Caroline Manzo, and Jacqueline Lorita. One thing led to another, and when Andy tried to hold Teresa back from Danielle, Teresa shoved him into his chair in a move that quickly went down in Real Housewives history. Source, Chronicles of Bravo, TikTok.